In this video, I will show you how to create your own 3D model quickly, export it as USDZ file, and view it on your device. I wanted to check out how easy it is to share 3D content using USDZ on my blog. First, I needed the 3D tool that allows me to create 3D content and hopefully also have a feature to export the 3D content to a USDZ file. After Googling a little bit, I found out about this amazing 3D design tool called Vectory. I've signed up and start using it straight away. The first thing that I did was to create a new 3D design. Then I clicked on the add-ons tab and chose the 3D text option. I dragged the add-on to the 3D view, changed the text, font family, font weight, in the properties window, as well as change the color of the text to red and added a metallic reflection to it. Exporting the 3D content to USDZ is very simple. You click the export button in the sidebar and choose USDZ file format. That's it. Now Vector will send you the USDZ file to your email, which you use to sign up for their website. The email contains some information about the USDZ file, which is nice. Then all you need to do is to click the Take Me There button. This will take you to the page where you can either get the HTML code to embed the USDZ on your website, download the file locally, or preview it using AR Quick Look on your device. What I did is just click the thumbnail to view it on my iPad. The default screen shows the object in object mode. To view it in AR mode, you need to click the AR button, which is right next to the object button at the top of the screen. Once this is done, position your device so it points to a surface. Once ARKey detects the surface, it spawns the 3D content on top of it. As you can see, the color and the metallic reflection that I've set up in Vectory remains. That's it. You can try follow those simple steps, create your own 3D model, and check it out on your device. Just keep in mind that the error option in Air Quick View requires an AirKit enabled device running iOS 12. Good luck.